Man, check this out, bro. 2K has been coming with the info left and right. And you know what I'm talking about? We just got to keep y'all updated, man. So we're going to do that, man. Like the little tidbits of information like this, where they just got the little stuff. You know what I'm talking about? The little expo. Leak, 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 leak. You know, hey, hey listen. Jetpacks confirmed. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Like, hey, we got stuff like that. He's at the park. Hey, you see you on the court. Crossplay coming to New Gen. All that good stuff, man. All this stuff is here. And we're going to talk about all this stuff, man. Even little gameplay leaks and footage and all this stuff. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video. Comment y'all thoughts down below. Also, shameless plug, man. Check this out. Y'all know we got the Breeze T site. I just got a new DTF printer. Uh, direct to film and bro it's gonna let me do some crazy stuff like this you got trucker hats man you can do your own custom trucker hat all you gotta do hey put your art you know upload your little artwork or, or whatever you got make it make it nice make it fit on the hat bow we got the foam trucker hats we have the we got the flat bill trucker hats let's see if you want a little goku joint on here you put it on here size it up how you want size it up real nice bow and then also last but not least we got the custom t-shirts for y'all man we did these before we doing these hey choose whatever shirts you want you want regular you want dry fit the, the, hey it all changes depending on what you do hey you want that goku on here bow and then hey boom and if you don't have anything custom man just make sure y'all just uh you know just go through the site we got lots of stuff lockdown university you know we got a lot of stuff different everything man so make sure y'all hit the site up man and do that and uh with with all that out of the way let's just get right on with the show man so check it out bro we've been getting like i said that was a good thing right there that was a good little leaky little leaky leak whatever y'all want to call it man um with you know like i said i, I would think that this tells us that jetpacks are coming back or they will be making a you know making i don't know if jetpacks was in there this year or whatever but hey you know we got jetpacks coming back i don't know i don't think anybody i don't know if anybody wanted it i don't know if it's the uh reward that we wanted or needed or asked for but hey it is what it is also 2k did an event i ain't get a chance to do a whole lot of lot with the event man but look man they got a they got to make a face like you're yelling like bro what they doing you know they just doing some stuff with the, at the event they got uh you know, I don't know who they, who they, Brandon Miller. Who, who did they say? Did they say Brandon Miller or something? All right, bro. Yeah, like I, I, bro, I don't know. Grady Dick looking like doggone. Uh, what's his name? Well, who Grady Dick look like, bro? Grady Dick look like uh, IQ contained over there, man. Hey, he looking like IQ contained over there, man. Yeah, it is what it is. But hey, look, you got Brandon Miller, Grady Dick. You got you got people getting scanned in. You got all types of stuff, man. You know, with 2K. Obviously, we just saw that commercial and all of that. And then you got your boy Power DF. He talking about some stuff, man. You know, they got the, the first look at the scoreboard in 2K24. I mean, it's leak, 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 leak. Hey, we got, you know, they said this is the first look at a, a photo or something like that, you know, of the screen or whatever. Uh, and then, like we said, and then he asked the question. This is the question. Will this be the year? that next gen finally takes over with the introduction of crossplay. I'm gonna tell you right here with the with the smoke ducking abilities of the people in our community, bro. I'm, I'm just gonna keep it a stack with y'all, bro. Um, I, I I don't think so. People gonna find a way to go back to current gen and be like, they are gonna be like, <laughs> I got a bigger following over there. It's this, it's that. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Hey, I ain't gonna lie though. You might be they, I, I, a lot of a lot of people that watch YouTube. A lot of the older people, like I said, if you a lot of the older people that watch YouTube they're on next gen and they don't really watch videos that are on 2k most of the older people on 2k are on next gen and they don't watch videos most of the, the children that are on 2k they're on current gen and they do watch videos so i definitely understand what what they're trying to say with that hey i just want to tap in with my core audience and all that good stuff but stop with the with the cap where it's like you know this is a better game is this and that bro you're gonna try to tell me it's a better game is it this one right here i think it's this stop the cap <laughs> Hey, stop the cap, man. Stop the cap. You gotta stop the cap, man. You stop, stop the cap, bro. It's, it's not a better game. It's not a better experience. It's not a better anything. Maybe it might be a better experience for you because you get more views and stuff like that, but that is the only way. And and the people that's over there, they, they're not over there because, well, I ain't a lot of, a lot of people are over there because like he just said, the competition is just a lot easier and, and my core audience is over there. So, you know, it is what it is. I, I digress, man. Uh, look, check it out. We got that boy, Mike, right here. I hit the wrong button. We got Mike up, Mike with uh, young Duke Dennis. He has ascended beyond 2K and now into uh, straight stardom. You know what I'm talking about? He one of the first people to get Mike. Mike, I thought we was friends, Mike. We supposed to be my close, my close, close personal friend. You follow me on Twitter, Mike. Can I get an invite out there, man? I'm trying to get out there and see what's popping, man. But like, 
like I said, man, you know, so they did the first round. They're inviting people out. A lot of people are looking at the game, checking it out. Um, I, I understand why they're not, why the content creators haven't gone out there yet because, bro, a lot of times when content creators go out there, it's just like negative central. You know, you want to, you want to, the casuals keep the game afloat. So they invite all the casual players out, which are the NBA players and, and you know, the, the content creators and stuff like that. That's who they invite out first. Um, you know, the people that don't do 2K content exclusively anymore. That's who they're going to invite out first. And then, you know, so they can get the casual point of view. Then, you know, as far as the mechanics and stuff, you know, they're probably going to invite. I don't know if they're going to invite everybody out or not. I haven't got my invite yet. Mike, I'll let you, boy. But, you know, it is what it is. So hopefully what will happen is, you know, I just won't. Even if even this game right here, even if they release this game and it's a little bit more tuned and a little bit more polished and, you know, a few few new features and stuff like that, I don't even think it's that bad. That Westbrook, though, Jesus, bro, they got, it's, I don't even know, but hey, hey, everybody needs to crutch, man. Up next, we got my boy, yo boy, dime work. He says, hey, this dude, talk, this dude is two and nine talking about if you don't pass me the ball, I'm going to sell. I said, little dumb dude. You been selling. Bro thought he was hooping. Told that dude, you <laughs> you get on here to lose every day. Now you finally got a chance to win and you want to mess that up too. Bro, that'd be killing me when people be acting like they sell. Like, look, a lot of times what happens is, bro, you, you're already selling. You, you, you're not selling. You're playing to the best of your ability. You can't play any better than what you're playing. And that's fine. But why, why everybody want to hide under the guise of, yeah, I'm going to say it. No, bro, you've been selling. It is what it is. And that's what we're talking about with the skill gap. Like, if there's no skill gap, then why do we got people in the game where some people are just completely terrible and can't hit shots? And, you know, and then you got other people that have no issue with the game, really. And they can see, they can really do everything. So, it, you know, I, I I don't know. I don't know if that's a skill gap. I guess it's not. I mean, that's, what, that's not what they call it. It, it is what it is. We're just going to rock with it and uh and see how it go. Up next. Hey, that boy, that boy Yadman, he says, hey, man, hey, the ultimate troll, a.k.a. You, I'm going to get all eyes on me. Imagine Rival Day being Xbox versus PlayStation the NBA 2K24. That would be awesome. The only only issue with that is that with crossplay, would, 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 would they do it so you play against each other exclusively? Like, like just for that day? You're just on one side and we're on another side. They just split it down the middle and then they turn the crossplay match making off. So it's only against each other in the event center. That would be cool. But then what happens if I get, if I squad up with my squad and then we go into the event center and then, you know what I'm saying? It's potential for a lot of problems there, but I do like that idea. Hey, a lot of people are saying, you know, the Xbox duck and smoke. A lot of people are saying PlayStation duck and smoke. I got all of it. Speaking of PlayStation, if I got a PS4 for sale, I don't know if anybody trying to get it. If you, if you, if you're interested in it, Hit me up, uh, Instagram, Twitter, whatever, man. Hit me up, and I'll, and I'll get y'all with that information or whatever. But last but not least, hey, that boy Don Work says, a lot of people don't realize that Limitless Takeoff was in the game before it was a badge. It was uh, it was just in the ratings. I, just, I remember noticing in 2K20, my blue and yellow would take off from anywhere. Uh, and that's what we always talk about, man. Like, a lot of stuff is already in the game. And they have to quantify it with either a badge or a rating or something like that. And then when they do that, it's like, okay, now we can we can control it. But sometimes they they program it, they they do the program and they put stuff in the game, and it just it just kind of rears its head or it just something that happens. And then they say, okay, well this happens. Let's find out why. And then they're able to quantify it with a badge or they put a rating on it, and then they can adjust it uh, up and down. So you know, it's pretty dope, man. Like I said, it's a lot of stuff in the game. Clamp breaker. Uh, been in the game like that in that iteration if your player had high strength um clamps were in the game before clamps was in the game if you like again if you had high strength and high perimeter those two things working together so a lot of stuff was in the game uh it's uh, ratings and badges and stuff like that and like we always say they can't take it out of the game because it may take the whole thing down and just blow up the whole system so they'll attach a badge or a quantity to it so that they can adjust the rating anyway y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section man are y'all excited for 2k24 i think i am man like no matter what i feel like the the advent of our uh, crossplay is gonna be dope and uh you know what i'm saying little little adjustments and stuff here and there but you know we also want to see some progression as well man but hey mike holla at your boy man i want to come out there for community today if y'all have it but anyway i'm about to get up out of here man make sure y'all go to breeze tees order some stuff man order some shit. And then, you know, uh, get your custom stuff, man. And I'm going to tell next time to the next time. It's your boy, Jay-Z, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Guys, please. Guys, please.